explain. I know, I know you can. You're a very, very gifted storyteller. That's it. Dude, would you just tell her, just tell her the truth. Like, just tell her the truth. Just cut his dick off. That's what I would have done. Shit, if you I was Norma. <laughs> Are you ready? We are here once again with some lost lost. I don't know what episode we're on. <laughs> so now we're gonna try to fool you okay this is season two okay so lost this is getting real juicy um i go as far as to say that the structure of lost is a lot better than prison break um according to my standards okay according to my standards some people may think differently because you know they're enamored <laughs> you know what i'm saying with with prison break um but who knows prison break might get knocked out of the top 10 because of lost <laughs> you know what i'm saying um depending on how strong they keep going um and keeping this mystery going and keeping me interested will depend on how they end up in my top 10 either way two great shows not finished with lost yet but we're getting there and anyways we're gonna jump into the episode but before we do that guys go check out the patreon you can watch all episodes early okay we're at least a season a season ahead every time i post a video on youtube we're at least a season ahead so if you want to watch these episodes early that is a great place for you to go um for some reason my original channel i don't even want to talk about memberships on the original channel because for some reason a few days ago they canceled the monetizations on my original channel i think it was a glitch in the system i think it's back now actually but i still don't want to teeter with it too much and tell you guys to go sign up there because it's you know, YouTube is, is is crazy right now. For a company that make billions of dollars, you would think, <laughs> you really would think that they would get, they would have their shit together. But apparently, you know, <laughs> they don't care. But either way, I think they did get it fixed. I think it was not just only happening to me. Um, it didn't happen to this channel here on Terabyte Reacts and Gaming, but it did happen to the original Terabyte Reacts. So either way. Let's jump into the reaction, and I will see you guys right after for the review. I wanted to take a good look at this. All right, let me see here. What I think this is, is I was actually um considering up uh, to you know i'm saying to you know a theory about what john saw here on the wall and i i think i mean if you pause because now that we can pause you know watching this live um you can actually see what happened and there's a lot of information a lot of stuff written down here um here they're talking about fatalities six to eight months fatalities complete shutdown in effect i think that i think that all of these here are all the bunkers i think this is all the bunkers that are on the island that's what i'm thinking i think these are all the the bunkers on the island you know what i mean that's what i'm thinking that's what i'm thinking Cause this is an octagon that that's what I'm thinking, man. I think that this is, um, 
yeah i i i definitely think this these are all the bunkers connected or uh because they point into a centerpiece i don't know what this is in the middle but i think all of them around here are all the bunkers on the island um you can see that there's a lot of information a lot of alleged information as well as the alleged location of number four the flame and all of this other stuff like this there's some information here this is like it's like a map you know what i'm saying you know one of the map that you see at the mall <laughs> one of the maps that you see that you see at the mall is just showing you all the the different store locations of the mall and then you would have the the um where you are on the map is like oh they're showing you like i am here right i don't i can't make out what this says the i don't know what this says the snake the it says something start starts with an s i can't make it out but say i am here so this is it, it's a map you know what i'm saying it's a map and i think these are all the bunkers one of them seems to be gone or one of them discontinued maybe i think this is the main one because this one is the biggest one i think this is the main one um yeah it's just my theory based on what i'm seeing here hey you gonna get that when's the last time you went in to see him a couple hours ago he was sleeping did he eat nope so, Henry, Henry, I was thinking about something you were saying before we found <laughs> His out His name is not actually Henry. Yeah, you were saying that if you were one of them, right. that you'd lead trap. us into a trap. Hey, us for you. Yeah, you did say that. <laughs> Pretty good idea, Henry. I'm going out to the line that we're not supposed to cross, and... Telling them that we've got you. So you could get back Michael. And if they want you back, it's gonna cost them. When we get Walt back. Oh yeah, they got Walt too, I forgot. You might just have been worth all the trouble. They'll never give you Walt. You guys are hella mysterious and Y'all not giving us no hints whatsoever about what's happening. Get out. You're not oh, we're finally getting your backstory. Okay, ease on the gas. Why are you no, behind? No, no. <laughs> no, I would have gotten it out eventually. Oh, sure. July's right around the corner. <laughs> oh, this is how they met. Okay. Uh, by the way, I'm Rose. Oh, so they haven't oh. been married a Bernard. long time because yeah. it. Um, uh, Bernard. Yeah. Really? Oh, she would be asked nice. them out. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fish and water. Hurley, what are you doing right now? Uh, talking to your wife. Good. Can you get Libby and meet me on the edge of the tree line in five minutes? Bernard, yeah. what are you up to? I got an idea. Hey, Richard, Chris, bro, come here. You want me to come with you? You need to stay here. You need it more than I do. Do yourself a favor, man. Don't go out there alone. All right. The giggles. Hey, yourself. I'm going back out into the jungle to talk to our friend with the beard. See if we can make a trade. And you're inviting me along because you want a gun, huh? I'm no. not inviting you. I <laughs> know he was not. <laughs> I've already got a gun, but thanks for offering. How the hell did you get a gun? I'll get my things. <laughs> okay, two months we've been on this island. Two months. Have you forgotten that we all crashed on this island? It's like none of you want to go home again. Well, how can you say that? Of course we want to go home. Well, then why aren't we doing anything about it? Dude, we, like, built a raft. So we are going to build a sign. 
a, a massive sign along the beach. So that way, if a plane flies over or a, a satellite takes pictures from up there, we want to make damn sure that they know we're here. <laughs> well, do we have to run everything by Jack? I, I mean, he's not the, the president. He's, he's a doctor. You're a dentist. <clears throat> uh, can, I, can I speak to you for just a second? Yeah. <laughs> the harm is you are telling these people about airplanes and satellites coming out of nowhere to save the day. I'm just trying to do something. Excuse me. I have a sign to build. Listen. I don't blame Bernard. I think I, I think that they should do this. <laughs> You're not impressed, huh? Yeah. So what does God have to do to get your attention? What are you he's, doing? He's gonna propose to her. <laughs> That's what. <laughs> oh. No, we just met five months ago. But five months is long enough. Because I knew after five minutes. Hey, Bernard. All right. I see you. Oh. Will you marry me? Uh, would you excuse us for a minute? I've been in remission for the last couple of years. But now it's back, and this time it's not going away. My doctor says I have about a year. Maybe a little longer. It's always a sad thing, bro. In the last, like, I want to say in the last three years, I've lost like three people Barely to cancer. It's. Yes. Yes. Anywhere? I need to talk to him. But then again, it's on the, it's Guns on the, the um, the door stays it's on closed. the blast door. Henry, can you hear me? Henry, did you enter the numbers? Henry, I need to know. I want you to answer me. Henry, you hear me? Gee. What? What he said? I think he's not so crazy about the whole carry the rocks a half mile thing. Okay, uh, look, this is gonna take time. I isn't that worth it? Rome wasn't built in a day, you know. But you're also choosing no, the easiest know. job okay. to do. Okay, all right, let's get started. Come on. Driving around in circles in the middle of the outback. That's why I wanted to be on a beach for our honeymoon. <laughs> I brought you out here because I want you to see this man. His name is Isaac of Uluru. Bernard, you brought me to a faith healer? <laughs> this is why you wanted to come to Australia? To bring me to some kind of a kook? No, he's not. Normally... I didn't ask for this! This is... Bernard, I have made my peace with what's happening to me. No, well, I haven't. I can't just do nothing, Rose. That's not me. That's not who I am. Will you try, Rose? For me. There might be some mysterious herb out there that cures cancer. Who knows? Paul, I hope you're happy. About what? This morning I had 15 people willing to work on the sign. Now I'm down to four. Well, how is that my fault? At the very least, I expected your support. Maybe the reason people are quitting is because you've got yourself a management problem. I am just trying to do something. That's exactly right. You're always trying to do. Why can't you just let things be? <laughs> if I didn't always have to do something, you wouldn't be here. That, that, that. 
He's like, you know what? I'm not even gonna say nothing to you. You shouldn't have said that shit. Straight up, you shouldn't have said that shit. What's that? The doll again. Hey. Don't don't. Good, so you can't hear me. <laughs> you want to reach those traps? So oh, she's not far from here. <laughs> It'll be a week before she shows up. Why would she use the doll, though? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, hey. though. It put me in this trap <laughs> with a vin <laughs> with a vaginally Lily. I don't want to shoot you. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'll be um, okay. you got it? a little uh, happier. Try to shoot the rope. Oh, hey. I'm what? a better shot than you are. <laughs> oh, really? The mill. Damn it! Well, I say know where we are. Okay, now give me the gun. You have a better angle than I. Anyway. Oh, that's gonna be your excuse when I make <laughs> the shot. When you make the shot. Yes. When I make the shot. <laughs> <laughs> Hey! Hey! No, 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 you're doing it all wrong. I told you three rows. Three so they can see it from the air. No, 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 no. Do I just have to do everything myself? Yeah. Would love to work for no, this guy. No, 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 Jin, no, wait. I want to get Rose home. You're not going about it the right way, though. Like, you got to learn how to work with people and stop being so... <laughs> I don't know if Rose is, um... I can move. I don't know if she got healed in Australia or she didn't. Oh, they haven't me. revealed that. <laughs> I saw your husband walking through the jungle, hauling rocks. He's building a big sign in the sand so the satellites will see it. So what are you doing down here, John? Can't remember the last time I saw you out of that hatch. I'm done with the hatch. Oh, now you're just frustrated. You'll be out of that splint and running around the island again in no time. Be at least four weeks. But honey, you and I both know it's not gonna take that long. Please, make yourself comfortable. Isaac will be right with you. I'm guessing these are all from people he healed. <laughs> so, um, how does this work? I sit here and you chant? Or, um, pray or what? What's on the earth? Like the one we're above now. Perhaps this energy is geological. Or perhaps it's something else. I harness this energy and give it to others. What? Right. What if this has something to do with the hatch? What? What is it? Sorry. Can't do anything for you, Russ. I didn't expect you to. What happened? This is not the right place for you. Where is the right place? I wish I knew. I'll return your husband's donation. Don't. I'm gonna tell him you fixed me. Oh, so Rose is still sick. I'm going to tell him you fixed me. What did you mean back there? What? In the net. You said they were sophisticated, the others. Uh, last week, when the baby got sick, Claire and I went into the jungle and uh, found another hat. When were you going to tell me this? For real. Just when now telling them. You decided to let this. me back in the club. 
Really, Mega? You can keep one of them locked up in the hatch for like a week and say nothing. But then when I just... That's where they took the shot at Sawyer. Right over there is where they push you out of the jungle with a bag on your head. You shot your man! You want him back? You're gonna have to come out here! Back in Australia, Isaac, he didn't heal me. Of course he did. You're, you're... Bernard, he didn't heal me. When you're sick and you have got something inside you that doesn't belong there, you can feel it. And after the crash, I couldn't feel it anymore. First, I thought it was just shock. But it wasn't. It's this place. Okay. I told you that so that you wouldn't spend what time we had left <laughs> trying to do something. Uh, Rose, you could just be in remission. How do you know it wasn't Isaac who healed you? How do you know that he didn't heal you? These yours? Thank you. Oh, so literally Rose is the only one knows that You're welcome. he was a cripple. You think if you leave, it'll come back. And if you can't leave. I can't leave. Can he won't ever leave Rose. So Rose, that's why she said that to John. I would uh because she realizes he's walking side, quite but, fine uh, now and it's like she understands that maybe there's a miracle for her too. Where'd you go? I just need to stretch my legs. I still wouldn't want to stay How I'm long are you gonna wait, Jack? <laughs> Till I get my voice back. And I'm gonna yell some more. I'm sorry I kissed you. I'm not. Is Jack gonna finally make his move here, man? Like, I'm tired of this. All these innuendos with these two characters, man. I'm... Somebody is running. Okay. Who is that? Is that Michael? Michael? Yeah. they send him okay so this was a pretty chill episode um we finally get to see the backstory of rose and bernard which was quite not what i ex not what i expected but at the same time i kind of expected <laughs> you know what i'm saying i could have kind of guessed that there that you know if we ever should see something that's going on you know a backstory on them that it would be somewhere in that vein i don't know why i don't know why i felt that way about this couple but as i said still nonetheless it was good to see um you know a backstory on both of them because you know they're they're kind of scattered out in whatever episodes that you that you really see them in and i've always been interested in the rose character and I don't know if they were ever going to make her like a prominent character in the show to go as far as to show a backstory about her. Um, so we found out she had cancer, as I mentioned, um, you know, in the, in the video while I was watching is that in the last, like, uh, uh, I want to say probably about three or four years, um, I've lost three or four people to to cancer i don't remember exactly i know it's kind of weird that i don't remember exactly how many i would have to consciously sit here and remember re um remember how many of them it was because i didn't go to all of the funerals because i couldn't go to all of the funerals so but i do remember four people specifically i do remember four people specifically that we lost even one this year earlier this year if you guys was around the channel at that time you remembered um i was talking about it and stuff like that that um that week i couldn't do any 
I couldn't do any reactions and, and, and stuff like that because I had to, you know, family get together and all of that stuff. And I couldn't do any recordings. I couldn't put out any reactions. So the channel was practically dead that week because at night, uh, even when I used to stream, I couldn't stream because, you know, visit with family and, you know, you know, everybody's getting ready for the, for the funeral and stuff. So cancer is one of those things that you can only hope, you know what I'm saying? That it doesn't happen to you or your loved ones, but, um, cancer is caused by so many different things, you know, um, just from the, the, just from the environment that we live in today, that is so everything is so mechanical and it's, it's, it's just involve a lot of these things that we consume and, you know what I'm saying? It's in our food. It's, it's just so many different things that can cause us, our body to break down and, you know, you know, um, become cancerous or whatever, what the, whatever the word is. Right. So the, the situation is when you watch something and you know that this is something that is very close to home, right. You have to, at least I have to respect it. I have to respect it because at the end of the day, I can understand the, the character and I can understand how to relate to this on a, a real level of shoot. I wish there was an Island out there that create miracles all the cancer people around the world, millions of people who, who have cancer, whatever kind of cancer it is, can just go live on this Island and, you know, and live out their days how it's intended to live out their days. You know what I'm saying? But I want to know what's causing this on the island. Is this just some miracle, miraculous island? Are we sacrificing, you know, babies? What, what is happening? You know, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like it, it's, it, there's so much, there's so much going on and I'm not going to sit here and try to deduce um, you know, every little thing that I see to say, okay, because it, it, a lot of the stuff is going against what we know as real, right? So I've seen, you know, people who have tremendous amount of faith die of cancer, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's, it's, it's a very mysterious thing to say the least in real life and also a mysterious thing in the show. So um, to keep it a buck, to keep it a buck, you know, I wish, you know, I wish there was some miracle energy as this guy <laughs> calls it, right? Um, some miracle energy that's out there. And the guy also described that place as, you know, we're above one of those energy centers, <laughs> you know, that's why we can give people miraculous healing. Now, I, I may sound like a, a weird person, but I've actually seen, you know, miraculous healing happen. Um, I've actually seen it with my own eyes, like witness it with my own eyes. Um, and I know people, you know, I don't like to, to talk about, you know, what I believe in. Um, I don't really like to talk about it on camera. Um, sometimes I might touch on the subject a lot because I'm, I'm a believer. I'm a believer. Um, I believe that there is a Supreme being that there is a God. Um, you know what I'm saying? I believe in, in God, you know, and not everybody, you know, shares the same beliefs. Um, and, and, you know, I'm not here to push that on every, on anybody, but I've seen these things happen through that one God for, for me. Right. It's I've seen, I, I've seen it with my own eyes. I've seen people pray for people and they get healed through that divine intervention. So it's like, it's, it's, it's weird. You know what I'm saying? It's weird because, you know, people can, people are going to try to debunk what you're, what you experience and say, Oh, it was magic or it was satanic, satanic, or it was demonic and all of this other stuff. And it was, and all this other stuff. There's a lot of things. It's kind of like this world is kind of like what this Island is. It's a very mysterious world and the things that we don't know that is operating around us and we don't quite understand. 
what it is. There's a there's so much unexplainable things that happens in the world and around us. You know what I'm saying? It it isn't. You know, my, one of my biggest questions is, you know, people say the Big Bang happened, right? Right. That's what caused Earth to happen, and human became. Ca- as a result of the big bang i think that's a load of baloney but <laughs> but but that's just me right that's that's just me right um that's just me but that's not that's not either here nor there um um you know when i talk to people i say okay so the solar system i i tend to not believe that i don't know because we'll never know <laughs> if life exists on other planets i don't know the Bible don't talk, don't talk about it. It don't mention it anywhere. So I don't know. It's because it's like the question is like I've brought this up when I used to go when I was going to church and stuff like that. I used to ask the question is like, you know, if we're here here on Earth, why can't we believe that there's other life forms out there in the world? They may not be human, but why can't we believe that you know or if god created the solar system why did he create the solar system (laughs) you know what i'm saying it's like why did he create all these galaxies and stars and all of these other and all of these other planets and then decide to put humans on earth and not anywhere else it's kind of it's kind of like it's a logical question to ask right but it's kind of like it's in a lot of times in with, with Christianity, a lot of things get pushed to the side. A lot of questions get pushed to the side because of this overwhelming belief that people may have. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, as I said, don't want to dive too much into that. Um, seems like Michael is back. I don't want to jump on that train too much because um, maybe they let him go. You know what I'm saying? On purpose because Jack was out there screaming. Um, maybe that's what they did. Maybe they are finished with Michael or whatever they did to him or whatever the situation is. So there's a lot to ask here. So I'm not going to just jump on a train and be like, Michael is back. whoop de doo Like, you know what I'm saying? We were just talking about what Kate found is like, yo, fake beards. And you know what I'm saying? And maybe they up their game and start cutting people's face off. Who knows? But that does seem to seem like Michael, right? And he seems like he, you know, maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, this was a great episode, man. Um, moving on to the next one. If you guys like my comments and you like my reactions, don't forget to hit the like button. Comment, subscribe if you're new. It's your boy Terabyte Reacts. I'm out. Peace.